This is Yvonne, and I'm here with Mayor Debbie Wakefield. How you doing, with Mayor? I'm good. Good evening. How are you? I am fine. I'm having a wonderful time here at the film festival. I'm meeting so many people, so many interesting people who are in the filmmaking business. We do have a lot of interesting people here. We have some people here from Canada, from Ghana. Um, I just met a gentleman that lives in L.A. right now, but he's from Barstown. <laughs> So wow. that was great. To, so he came here for the film festival. Mm -hmm. So I, he's back here to visit with some of his relatives. So it just worked out for him. But uh, we're very excited. And I can't wait tonight to uh, do some of the reviewings of the uh, shows that they have planned. Mm -hmm. So we got a big night ahead of us. Big night. Long night. Long night. Long night. night. Okay. Now, what, I know it took a lot to get this all together. It took a lot of people to put this film festival together. You want to tell us a little bit about that? How, how long ago did you guys get started on this? Well, actually, I can't take credit for this. That's Stephanie McMillan, who is our tourism director and the tourism board. Uh -huh. Along with, we, the city council did, they've had some input, but uh, she has been very active working with uh, the tourism commission mm -hmm. in Frankfurt and the, and the film commission. Um, up there. Uh, we've been working on having a sound stage here. That was the start of it. So we've been brainstorming. Uh -huh. we, we've been doing a lot of brainstorming and so she has been working and working hard behind the scenes mm -hmm. and um, getting everything done. Getting now, it done. We've got different genres here. We've got uh, some dramas. We have some comedies. What's horror. Your, what's, your what's, your what's your favorite? What's your favorite? My favorite is going to be a horror. A horror movie? Yes, well, I will I, be here t tonight. To, oh, for the actually, zombies. in the morning. It's like at 2 or 3 o'clock in the morning to watch. The zombies are here tonight. I, I will be here. <laughs> That's my plan. <laughs> well, listen, thanks for talking to us and congratulations. Well, Looks thank like you so much. having a wonderful time. Well, stick around and have a wonderful time with us. Right, okay, sure thank you. Uh -huh. I'm here now with Stephanie McMillan, who is a director of tourism for the city of Springfield, and you're the one who kind of got this all together here. Yes, it's Springfield's first film festival. We're so proud of it, and I thank everybody for coming out and supporting it. And also, you may have seen the logo out there, the Hollywood South Film Festival, and you did that too. You're very creative all around. Right? Thank you so much. Yeah, I've been able to get a lot of mileage out of it, and uh, as you can see on the step and repeat, we hope the whole world shares it. Exactly. Now, we were talking with several of the filmmakers and several of the individuals who are here, and the tourism's job is to bring different new people to Springfield, and I think that's been accomplished here because you have some international representation as well as people from various states. And when I talk to them, this is the first time they've ever been to Kentucky. I'm proud that they get to, their first stop is Springfield. Right. Beautiful downtown Springfield in the Opera House and to have uh, such a nice new theater to have our film festival in. I'm very uh, excited that they uh, saw the value in the film festival and chose to come over here. Absolutely. And upstairs we did our first kickoff in the new facility up there. It's not the revamped facility, but you added it to make it into a movie theater as well as a theatrical theater. Absolutely. Back when my dad was a kid living here in Springfield, it was called the Majestic and that's where everybody came and as you know back in the day they had newsreels and things like that well we're having a similar version of that with uh, TV shows and movies so something to do downtown Absolutely, that's fantastic now this is the first annual Hollywood South Film Festival and we're calling it annual because we're hoping to have it come every year right I might have to come up with a new term because, and uh, you heard it first here on Channel 6, that um, December uh, 789, we're having a Christian film festival. And then in 2019, in October, we're having another film festival. Oh, as well as the same one in um, uh, July of 2019. Okay. So you're going to have being film festivals every six months or so? Well, Kentucky's uh, tax credit for the um, for filming, it's being revamped. And as uh, a lot of people know, it took sort of a hit in the legislative season, uh, you know, a few months ago. And it looks like it's being reworked. Numbers are coming in to show what a good ROI why it has and it's gaining momentum again so we're just preparing for it and um, all the new product that's being made in Kentucky has a home right here in Springfield. Absolutely. Now also speaking of a home in Springfield, Springfield is the only place in Kentucky where there is actually a sound stage for film and TV. Right? We are so proud of it. The Springfield Bonded Film Complex is Kentucky's first and at the moment only sound stage. And the man who that's named after, Jim Bond, is actually one of the ones who made this all happen right for the film festival. Absolutely. It came about because he was looking at St. Catherine's College for a possible uh, teaching facility and soundstage, and it didn't really work out, but we had other facilities here that were appealing to him, and he's choosing to make this his new home. 
Fantastic. And again, I'm talking with Stephanie McMillan, who's Director of Tourism for the City of Springfield. And we're here for the Hollywood South Film Festival in Springfield. Thank you. Yes, thank you. I'm here now with James Bond III, who is the man behind the Springfield Bonded a soundstage that is going to be here in Springfield. Film Complex. Film Complex that's going to be here in Springfield. And also the guy behind this film festival, the Highwood South Film Festival. So tell us a little about yourself, if you would, and how you ended up here in Springfield. Oh, goodness gracious. It's a long story, I know. Well, that's a, you know, answer to that question. I mean, that, that's, that's a really, really long story. Uh, uh, I'm going to give you the drive-by version. Okay. Okay. Uh, the drive-by version would be uh, well, I grew up as a critically acclaimed, uh, no, excuse me, grew up as a child star, mm -hmm. uh, became uh, a critically acclaimed filmmaker as an adult, and, uh, and uh, am the founder of um, uh, a company that produces and acquires and globally distributes commercial independent movies, records, television, programming, you know, publications uh, we're now developing as well. And, um, and, um, and that kind of tells the, 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 the story of the career path thus far. That's, thus far, right? Because now you're in Springfield and there's a whole lot more to come, there's right? A lot more to come. So tell us about the Springfield Bond uh, uh, what is it, the Springfield Bonded Film Complex that's going to be here in Springfield. Is it open yet? Yeah, uh, it, it is in place. Uh, it is being developed. And uh, it, 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 is, it, is, it is in the, what we call the, um, an aspect of the development process. Uh, it is here. Uh, it is uh, a real uh, scenario, real entity. And, um, and it was a specific, it, you know, it was designed to be an enhancement to the uh, film tax credit here in Kentucky. Absolutely. So, you know. Um, That's kind of what brought you here was the tax credit. Right? It, it, it's what got my attention. Right. And, I, and I realized after assessing, uh, you know, the, the warmth of, of, of uh, the people here in Springfield, the, the warmth and their desire to have, uh, you know, Kentucky be a, f a place where film is in fact made, a film friendly place. Uh, at that point I realized that um, there was a need uh, to be filled in terms of there being a soundstage in place. If you've got the film tax incentive, that's only one uh, facet of the of the of the of the of the of the puzzle. Uh, you you've got to have this other aspect in place to to make it cohesive. Absolutely, that's fantastic. Now we're here for the first annual. Hollywood South Film Festival here in Springfield, which is in conjunction with the Springfield Bonded Film Complex. Yeah. Now, how many films are you going to be screening? And in, and in conjunction with the city of Springfield. Right, absolutely. Very importantly, they work tirelessly and very hard to put this event together, and, 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 they, and they've, been, they've been very much a... a, a um, um, they, they've been very visionary. In, in terms of, of, of wanting to see Springfield succeed in the realm of film. And, um, and uh, you know, they've been tremendous. Absolutely. So tell us how many, where it's three days, it's Friday, Saturday, and Sunday this weekend. How many films are you going to be screening here? Goodness gracious. Did you do the process of actually screening for yeah, the film? We, yeah, absolutely. We, me and my team, I got some team members that are here. Um, and uh, and uh, it's a bunch of movies. It's a bunch of. It's, yeah. it, not only is it movies. It's it's movies. It's um, it's new media. Uh -huh. uh, it's shorts, um, feature films. You know, it, 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 it runs the gamut. It's 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 a wonderful event. Absolutely, it's a wonderful event. I know it's all day long, so it's going to be dozens of films that are going to be screened here. M right. Much more than that. Absolutely, that's fantastic. And hopefully much this is the first... media than that. Much more media than that, yeah. Absolutely. A lot of media. Absolutely. And so we are here again. I'm here with James Bond the third, who is now in Springfield. You're, are you living with us here in Springfield now? I'm, I'm, I'm in the... I am in the re relocation process. I'm looking for property, actually, as we speak. Because you are living in Los Angeles, right? Well, actually, I was living in Los Angeles, 
transferred over to Colorado and uh, you know been there some years and and now you know next step is Kentucky. Okay, it's Springfield, fantastic. Springfield. So <clears throat> exactly. So keep an eye out for Mr. Bond and for the Springfield bonded film complex that will be opening in Springfield very shortly. Thank you very much. Thank you so much. All right.